It's so nice to finally take you out. I've been waiting for this. Yeah. Are we almost there yet? Yeah, we're like just in five minutes. I've got some good stuff planned. Are we in the ghetto? No. What is all this trash? I've been planning this for a while. We're fine, baby. Not you touching me right now. Because I don't come out often, so. Well, I'm glad I got to take you out. Uh, so where are you taking me? Right up here. Cheesecake Factory? Be fucking for real. Cheesecake Factory? Yeah. You know, I'm actually really happy to finally get to be on this date with you. I've been looking forward to this the whole week. The reason I didn't go out with you the first time you asked me was because you were trying to take me on a coffee date. I don't know what type of guys you've been with in the past, but I'm worth more than a coffee date. Cheesecake Factory is crazy. It's giving you're on a budget. No, no, no. I come here all the time. I promise you'll love it. Because these pants are 400 bucks, t-shirts $100. That's worth more than a $7 coffee. I don't know if you're used to being with just broke guys, but I have standards. So if you're going to take me out, you just better come correct. No, no, yeah, I get it. You're, you're a really amazing guy. You're super handsome and you have really high standards and I hope to meet those. I just want to show you that like I'm different from the other girls. I mean, I've never been to like the ghetto before. So like, what do they have here? I mean, they have a lot of good appetizers. My favorite is the mozzarella sticks. All these choices. Like, why is there so much on this menu? I already have trouble making up my mind on what I want to I order mean, and you take me here. Chili! Wait, what? Where are we going? To Chili's. No, be fucking for real. Where are we going? To Chili's. Yeah, I don't know if I can do this. Why? When I go home and I tell the homeboys, she took me to Chili's. <laughs> Chili's is fucking disgusting. You told me you were like an actress, so I thought you had some motion, some things going for you. Well, I wanted to bring you to like a sentimental place. Look, if you're broke, just say that. Do you know what you want yet? I was thinking the Smokehouse barbecue burger. Um, Chili's is like disgusting. No, they have like really good food. I mean, have you ever been to Applebee's before? Again? Applebee's? What the fuck fucking for real? You did not just say Applebee's. Ah, where's the waiter? <laughs> it's taking uh, so long. I mean, we just got here. At Catch, they're like this quick. What's Catch? Like? You've never been to Catch LA? No. No, I haven't. It's giving broke. No, I love the chicken enchilada soup. You gotta try it. Well, this is giving very much soup kitchen vibes. Isn't this like where all the homeless people congregate? I mean, Margo, look at those disgusting broke workers over there. This is like a sewage waste man place. These brokies are eating this type of shit. So like, do you have a job or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, right now I'm employed at Starbucks. Wait, you work at Starbucks? Yeah, yeah, I love it there. To be honest, I'm just thrown off right now. I thought you said you had something special planned for us. Babe, can you just get out of the car anymore. Not you calling me babe. We just met. Can you just get out of the car, please? Just get out of the car. Not you trying to tell me what to do right now. My friends have my location, by the way. This is giving very controlling. I'm not controlling. I don't take demands from car. a woman. I'm an independent man, and I am not going to take orders from a woman. So what's the dating history looking like? Like, how many girlfriends have you had? Are you asking about body count? No, 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 no. I didn't mean it that at all. Asking about body count on the first date is crazy. It's giving insecure, but, like, keeping track of who you've been with and stuff, like, okay, I've slept with like 200 girls, but for you to even be concerned about that, like, who even keeps who even keeps track? It's insecure and like yeah. weird to keep track of that. Yeah, I, I apologize. That was my fault. I'm sorry. Come on, let's go. Get out of the car. When I tell my homeboys later that you took me to Chili's, they're not gonna believe this shit. This is crazy. Who did she think? Get out of the car, please. I'm not getting out. Can you just please get out? I'm not getting out. If only you knew the type of girls that are begging for me right now. I have so many girls I could be with right now, and I'm here with you. What do I bring to the table? I know you did not just ask that. Girl, bye. Even asking the question, what do you bring to the table? I'm so tired of hearing that question. First off, I'm insulted you to even ask me that. What I bring to the table is something you can't even measure. I'm a high value man. My vibe, my energy, being in my company will elevate you. Nah, bro, she's actually taking me to Chili's right now. You can't make this shit up. Why are you so concerned about what I bring to the table? Like relationships shouldn't be about, oh, you get this and I get this. Yeah. Why, is, yeah. why are you making it seem like no, it's transactional. I, I, was, I totally, I was not trying to do that at all. I was just trying to, like, you know, get to know you. You gotta be joking. Look at these people. This doesn't make any sense. Are you sure you're supposed to be doing that? It's giving controlling. Are you like addicted to that or? Am I addicted to this? I'm not addicted. I could quit whenever I want. I just do it for fun. Is our food here yet or like what is going on? We did just order like two minutes ago. <sighs> I don't even know what I want. There's too many options here. At Catch, there's like 10 items. How do we have seafood, American food, and Italian food at the same place? That doesn't make any sense. So what do you do? What's your job? What's my job? Yeah. I'm a content creator. Oh, what do you do? 
awesome. It's like content, um, modeling, oh, like awesome. OnlyFans and stuff. Oh, oh. You probably take every guy here. Oh, baby. This I is like your go to. You I've only taken you here. You probably say those same lines to every guy. I do not. I do OnlyFans and then I'll do like, I mean, I have four sugar mamas who kind of like buy me stuff. I don't even meet up with them in person. They just like pay for stuff. One bought me this cardigan. And they don't even live here. Like, one lives in like Nebraska or something. What are you getting? Thinking about the egg rolls. <laughs> be fucking for real. You did not just say egg rolls. You didn't give me a girl type of girl. She's getting egg rolls. So, um, the OnlyFans situation, like, can you tell me more about that? Or, like, I mean, is it a problem that I do OnlyFans? No, 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 no that's not what I meant. I don't I'm just curious. I do, like, solo stuff, like, just modeling. I'll, like, fuck some girls on there from time to time. I'll have, like, girls suck my dick on there. Again, you're not you're not trying to make it seem like. No, are no. Are you judging me for. No, 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 no. That's, that's not okay. at all what I'm trying to do. Because no. I've met a lot of insecure girls who no. they have a problem with me having getting head on my OnlyFans no. and it just, I think it just shows like the girl's insecurity by not letting me do what I want like if you're gonna be with me you're gonna have to support my lifestyle I'm not a regular guy no yeah I can do that I can for sure do that there's like a lot of things that come with being with me I hold things to like a higher level you okay did. so you're cool with OnlyFans and stuff and modeling like if you didn't date me because of OnlyFans I mean that would be so messed up yeah it seems like you have a problem with it no no I mean, I feel very empowered as a guy when I'm able to just have like my dick out and stuff. Uh, it's very empowering and then you, you've got a girl just going to town. It's very liberating as a guy. I only really mess with athletic girls. I'm only into girls that are athletes. Oh. Have you done any sports or like what's your background in like athletic activities? I mean, I used to do soccer. So how much do you weigh? I look like 119. 119, damn. Yeah, most of the girls that I've kind of been with have always been like 110 and under. Cause like, I can't be with no big bitch. My girl needs to be athletic. They need to be taking care of themselves. I take care of myself. I have a great figure. I, I work out. I have abs. So how long do you plan to be like going on with this OnlyFans thing? So whenever, like I don't really have a timeline on it. For me, like the type of vibes I'm on, I just manifest shit. So I manifested like a hundred grand at the beginning of this year. Made it. Really? Mm -hmm. From the OnlyFans? Just like OnlyFans and stuff. But it was it was more about I manifested it. Take that real quick. I thought you said you didn't like the nachos. Well, I mean, you already ordered them. They're already here now. Do you want some more? Or? No, I'm fine. Those are yours. Oh. That's fine. I'll probably just take that one, though. What about the last one, though? Oh, this looks fire. So much for a gentleman first. Oh, I I'm sorry. Here. Sorry. You're just grabbing it for yourself first. So, like, what's your dress size? Mm. What is zero? A zero? Yeah, I'm like tiny, right? I'm more of like a double zero type of guy. Like, if you can't get small for me, that's fine. Do you like it? I mean, it's not something I would ever order, but. I, I mean, I could totally grab you something else. It's fine. It's fine? Or yeah, sure? it's fine. It's fine. Really, it's fine. So, there's something I need to tell you. I don't really show it on my social media or anything like that, but I do have a son, and he's two years old, and I'm looking for, like, a real woman to step up to the plate to take care of us. Take care of? Yeah. What do you mean, like. I just come across so many insecure, disrespectful, women and girls that just don't really have that in them. And I'm looking for a real woman to take care of my son, Aiden. So, what are we doing after this? I mean, I didn't really have anything, like, planned. We could do, like, dinner and drinks. We can go to a bar. Dinner and drinks is crazy. What? What? You think, like, I know you've not been on a date with a guy like me before. A guy of my caliber, like, dinner and drinks is almost insulting. You've got to actually do something with me. Like, I had to get a haircut. I had to put on this thing. My moisturizer is, like, $120 just to put this on. Oh. So, I was like, dinner and drinks is not, it's not really worth my time you see what I'm saying and I'm not looking for like a stepmom to take care of us I'm looking for like a real mom to step up to the plate because there's like a lot of fake women out here so like if you're secure within yourself and have the funds to provide then you could step up to the plate and fulfill that role for us and me and the mom like we're like on and off here and there but she's like batshit crazy she's violent is there anything you, you want to do is there anything I want to do so you haven't planned anything well I just don't I want to be on a date with a girl who can plan shit it shouldn't be on me to be planning stuff no I understand that you're the girl you're supposed to be like setting the plans leading the way yeah you're right i'm probably gonna get a to-go box for this it's giving food shortage do you not have like food at home i mean i would love to take you out again and we could do something a little bit more extravagant or something more to your taste i mean if i had a dollar for every time i heard that honestly if you even wanted to do something again you're gonna have to venmo me for my haircut i mean you're gonna have to pay for my outfit and probably give me some new jays or something because i'm not coming out again unless you're like spoiling me 104 do you want to split it I'm just kidding. I'll just, I'll take care of it. You know, because I asked you out. What kind of car do you have? Do you have like Bank of America or more American Express? Bank of America. Interesting. I just want to make it clear. I'm not one of your like regular guys that you talk to. I'm like on another level. No, I mean, I really like spending time with you. Honestly, you're one of the most handsome guys I've ever met. Like, I know that. Like, I know that I'm handsome. But is that all I am to you? Is this... No, 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 no. No, that's not what I was trying to say. It just seems like you're trying to just have sex with me. I know that I'm more than just a, a handsome face. 
Oh, it's cold out here. Yeah. It's really cold. Oh, oh, here. Yo, I think there's like homeless people out here. Can we go? Oh, okay. I don't feel safe. Wait, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my God, it's giving clumsy. I'm really cold, actually. Me too. Let's be for real for a second. What do you even like about me? Handsome, of course. You seem... It just seems like you only want sex. No, I haven't mentioned that at all tonight. I've... I know you haven't mentioned it, but yeah. it feels like you just I... want to fuck me and then I'm... bounce. So this is your car. Yeah. I didn't really even pay attention to what kind of car you had. What's this scratch right here? Oh, I think you like, kind of like drove into like a pole or something. It's okay it's though. It's giving I'm reckless. Be, I'm a really... Not you trying to grab my hand. I was gonna put you in the car. So, are you free after? After this, you wanna do anything? We could go back to my place or something. You wanna go back to your place? I mean, yeah, we could. I mean, we just met. No, not not like that. It Literally. just seems like you're only focused on sex. No. Like, go back to your place? No. I never go back to girls' places on the first link. No, that's like, not what I meant at all. I actually I have respect for myself. What kind of car is this? Is this like a Toyota model or? Audi A4. Is this one of like the oldest models? I mean, yeah, it's like an A4. Oh, it's still eight. really expensive though. Yeah, I've never heard of it. The girls that I was with in the past, they had like a BMW with like four Giotto rims. What happened over here? You hit something? I guess, yeah. So do you want to get in the car? Or? I mean, where are we going? I mean, we can go back to my place or yours. And hang ah, out. I knew it. This whole time, you just wanted me to get back to your place so you could sleep with me. What? I'm no. just some dick to you. I'm just community dick. No, 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 no. You just want to sleep with me. No, I, I don't want to sleep. We don't have to sleep together. I want. We to ate at Chili's and now you want to fuck me. No, I want to hang out with you. I'm sure you say that to everybody. You just want to hang out. You want my dick. I, I cleared my whole schedule for you. Like, what we, did you want to do? We, huh? Yo, there's a, um, a skating rink. If well, you want. I don't want to do that. Bowling? Girl, do I look like I could bowl? Be uh, fucking for real, bowling? I thought you had a whole plan for well, today. I don't know. I, I, I'm sorry. Um, is there anything like you want to do in particular? Or? You're asking me what I want to do on our date that you're supposed to plan. Be fucking for real. You just want to fuck me. You just no. want me for my dick. I'm a slab of meat. Of course not. You know what I'm saying? No, of course not. Stop, stop, stop. Chill out. Let's just get into the car and then we can just hang out and figure out what we're doing, okay? Come on. 